So first thing we are going to do, we're going to change the name. We're going to change the name from what it was firstly, and then we're just going to name it Beth. Next thing we're going to do, we're going to go over to the left side, and we're going to go pick Modified. And then we're going to click Create New Object. We're going to drag it over, and we're just going to put it right there. And then next thing, next thing that we're going to do is go to Shapes, and then we're going to go and get the box, which is at the very top, and drag it over. To, and then we're going to put it underneath the Create New Object. And the next thing we're going to do is change the color because we're going to be making the frame and we're going to make it the color brown. And then we're going to change our width to 3.5, our length to 30. And we're going to keep our edge the same, but we're going to go over here and change our edge steps to zero. The next thing you want to do, you want to go back to modify and you want to go to move and drag the move to be underneath the box. And then you're going to change all the zeros just to a regular 0.1 for every single one. Yeah. And then after you're done with that, you're going to use the rotate code and you're going to drag it over here and we're going to change the access x to access z and we're going to keep the 90 degrees because yeah and the next thing we're going to go to scale drag the scale over and then we're just going to keep all the ones and then after that we're going to just press play to see how our progress is going so far So this is what it looks like so far. And the next thing you want to do, you want to go back to shapes, go to a box, drag it over once again, under scale. You want to press the arrow so you can see all this. And you want to change the width to 3.5 like you did the first one. You want to change the length to 30, just like the first one once again. And once again, we're just going to keep the same edge, and then we're going to change the edge steps to zero. And then after that, we're going to get a move. We're going to go to modify and get a move code. We're going to connect it to there, and then we are going to make it point 0.1. We're going... For the X, we're going to do 0.1, and then for the Y, we're going to do negative 50. And then for the Z, we're just going to keep it a zero. And, uh, and the next thing you want to do is do a rotate. And then you're going to change the access to Z like the first one. And then just keep the 90 degrees and stuff. And then we're going to go to scale once again. And we're going to drag the scale, put it underneath, and then we're just going to keep the scale the same way. And then we're going to see how it's going to look. So I forgot to change the color, so we, we are going to change the color now. We're going to change it to a brown so it can match up. And then let's do it again. I'm going to speed it up a little bit. Okay, and then after that, we are going to go to our third block. So we're going to go to Shapes. Go to box, connect it to the scale, and then we are going to change it to 3.5, the width of 3.5, and the length to 30, and the edge to 20, and then we are going to Next thing we are going to do is we're going to change the change the add steps to zero once again, and then we're going to add another code of move. We're going to go to modify, then move, put it right underneath, and we're going to change this one to a change the x to 
point zero. I'm at point one. And then we are going to change it to the we're gonna get the y to a zero. And then we're gonna change the z to a twenty. And then after that we're gonna do a, another rotate around. And then we're gonna do a z axis like the other ones. And then we're gonna do 90 degrees. And then after that, we're going to see how it looks so far. And it should look like this, and we got to change the color once again. Got to change it to brown. And yeah, we got the frame done. And now we're going to move on to the bed area. So, and then we're going to bring this on top. We're going to scroll down. And then we are going to go to shapes. Go to a box. And then we're going to change the color to white. And then we're going to change the width to 50. Height to 35. And the edge, we are just going to keep the same. And then we're going to change the change this one to 10 because yeah and then next thing we're gonna do we're gonna get a we're gonna go to modify get a rotate around we're going to change the access to z once again and we are going to keep it at 90 degree degrees and then we're going to go get a move code we're going to put it underneath the rotate around and we are going to change this to a 1 and this to a negative 45 and to and to and then change the z to 1 and then after that we're going to go to shapes once again we're going to go to a box because we're about to do the pillow but let's see how the mattress looks so far and see if we've messed up on anything before we start on the Okay, and then this is going to be our pillow, so don't mind the red thing, but this is our mattress, our frame, and our frame. And then our mattress, we're going to, I mean our pillow, we're going to change it to whatever color you like. I'm going to change it to this lavender color. I'm going to change the width to 15, and I'm going to change the height, I'm at the length, to 15, and change the height to 25 and the edge step I mean the edge to 5 and keep the edge step at 10 and then next thing you want to do you want to get go to modify get a move code and you want to change the X to negative 1 change the Y to negative 10 and change the Z to 10 just a regular number pen then you're gonna go get a rotate code you're gonna change this to a y axis and just keep it at a 90 degree angle and the next thing you want to do is see how it went so far okay and that seems like about it, and this is how you make a bed. It, uh, you can add a, a blanket if you want to. I don't really know how to, but yeah, this is how you make a bed. I hope you guys enjoyed, and yeah, bye.